Hello and welcome to Ecom Premium. Today we will set up campaign in TikTok Ads Manager and we'll see how we can create and start a successful campaign using TikTok Ads Manager. So if you are in your ads manager, you can just click on here on campaign section and then you can click on create. After when you will click on create, it will take you to this window. Now we have this window after clicking on create new campaign. Here you can see that we have few objectives um, that has been already shown on new campaign creation. The first one is awareness, reach. Show your ads to the maximum number of people. So, if you are starting with the very first, very, very new TikTok Ads Manager account, I recommend you to please go with this uh, reach campaign at the very first. So, after approving your campaign, ad groups, and ads, it will start spending instantly after you choose this reach campaign because if you are going with conversion campaign just after signing up on google uh, tiktok ads manager then it will definitely not gonna be spent anymore even if it's approved your campaign is even if approved so don't try with conversion at the very beginning so in reach we will select reach and then we have campaign name reach first this is for our own ease and then here in tiktok ads manager we have option of create split test test ad groups against each other to understand which strategy give you the best results your potential reach will be divided among your ad groups for accurate split test results so if you are just testing at the very beginning you can switch it on otherwise you can go with uh, no budget limit for the very first campaign in the reach and then you can click continue okay after creating campaign you have to create the ad group right and you can also give the ad group name first ad group okay and then after you can go to placements in placement you can click on advanced settings you can even disable video download options and you can put this on enable because um, some potential customers will click on your as as a comment so then in the creative type you can even go with automatic creative optimization but this one is not recommended if you are very beginning starting with your ad account and then in the audience you can select some categories in the audience so here you can search You can also refresh okay here you see um, due to data security requirements this figure does not include audiences under 18 years of age any delivery as permitted by applicable laws will not be affected so we are going to have an audience here okay if you select age limit 18 to 24 hopefully we will see the audience now
okay you have to create a new audience if you don't have anyone or you can even go without any specific audience and then in the demographics you can select any country you want and then in the gender it depends on you that um, which gender is your most targeted coverage and then for age limit i prefer to select first three like from 18 to 44 and then in the languages you can even select English or whatever your um, country is preferred with the language. Okay, in the interest and behaviors, you see that uh, it will depend upon uh, which type of products or ads you are going to run. So we will be just. Uh, it's also suggesting us that and this will help in conversions. So we'll be looking at more audiences here uh, so these are already suggested audiences so we'll click on apply and then you see there is also some similar interest okay and then we have all the interests applied and select a time period to include actions from uh, 15 days and uh, then people who carried out the following interaction with creators uh, already applied add behavior hashtag interaction so in here you can give hashtags Here you see we got hashtags you will get the trending hashtags here and then in the devices it's up to you which devices you want to select and then in the carriers it's also up to you and then device per price uh, it's up to you and then here it comes the budget and schedule you can have at least 20 euros or 20 dollars budget per ad group so we'll be starting with 20 euros and it's a daily budget you can also select lifetime budget and then you can also give a starting and end date or you can schedule your ad you can also select all days if you have enough budget and then in the bidding optimization optimization goal is reach frequency cap is show ads no more than three times every seven days and uh, bid strategy is bid cap keep your average cost per result lower than your bid and here's just a minimum bid is 2.34 euros set this bid or higher to maximize campaign performance so we will be selecting 2.35 right and then in the advanced settings you see we have billing event impressions cpm cost per milli and then delivery type is standard and then we will be clicking next After selecting all these things, you will be moved towards Add. Now we are in the Add section. You can give your creative some name for your recognition. Like first Add. And then in the Identity, use TikTok account to deliver Spark ads. You can disable it. And in Set Custom Identity, you can create your identity or your product your service your website your Shopify store name here and then in the add details you can select a single video here you can even select it from the library you already uploaded videos uh, you can have your standard tiktok videos like this so after selecting your video you can 
put some text as a text here and then you can okay and here in the interactive add-ons is optional you can even um, give it or not here you see oh, all things that we were entering are coming up here like this in our ads and then your destination page you can even give a destination page like after clicking on your ad where people will be going like if you enable it you can put your website url here like this and then after selecting the destination url you can also give your tiktok instant page as well instead of website and then call to action you can select dynamic or standard we recommend dynamic and then by checking this box you agree for the ads and the associated performance metrics metrics of the campaign to be displayed in the tiktok for business creative center and here in the tracking you can even leave it or if you want to track with your third party tracking settings you can put the url here and then these are optional and then when you click on submit your campaign will went to review process and uh, once your campaign is approved you will see the results in here in campaign sections just like uh, we are clicking on it and uh, it's saying changes you made may not be saved we will say okay leave and uh, after submitting your campaign once it's it will go to review section and here in the review you see after getting approved it will become status active here and you see you will your campaign will start spending having some impressions clicks and then conversions as well so this was the campaign complete setup including ad groups including as for reach objective so hopefully you understand how we create a reach campaign with ad groups and as in tiktok as manager if you haven't subscribed our channel yet do subscribe it and press the bell icon for upcoming videos thank you so much bye bye